And a very pleasant good afternoon and welcome to Red Bay, Alabama for some junior high basketball. Eighth grade tournament going on. This is a double elimination seven team tournament. And on Saturday there'll be some ninth grade little round robin going on here. Red Bay Tigers, big winners over the Halo Lions last night. We'll play the Belmont Cardinals here on night number two of this tournament. And we're ready to get it underway. Belmont in the white, in the orange is the Red Bay Tigers who got off to a really great start last night. Amber Kelton with the basketball, working it right side to 21 Sarah Williams and Tigers trying to take it down low and the ball out of bounds. Belmont Cardinals bring it down. That's Moody with the basketball, number 23. Moody kicking that ball back out and the Cardinals will set it up with Dana Malone. Dana down to the baseline, shot is up. No good by Caroline Gross. Rebound over here by Payne. Now to Gross. Gross driving the baseline, puts it up off the glass. It's no good. And that ball is going to get out of bounds and belong to the Red Bay Tigers. So Red Bay will be playing with the ball in. Red Bay gets it into 14. That's Leith. Back to Kelton. Kelton in some traffic there. And she is going to Lose that ball out of bounds. Belmont, Michaela Stevens will do the inbound. She wears number 25, Dana Malone, 20. 14 for the Cardinals is Carmen Payne. 23 is Caitlin Moody. And number 22, of course, Caroline Gross making out the Cardinal roster for the Red Bay Tigers. We had them on board last night with Amber Kelton, uh, Caitlin Leith, also Sarah Williams out there, along with number 15, Sydney Harden. And... Also number 33, of course, is Grace Pendergraft. Cardinals with the basketball, trying to take it inside of Malone. There's some traffic there. She'll bring it back out. Jack Ivey, Randall Lindsay here on the Ivey Broadcasting Company. We're WRMG, TV 12, and TV 97. If you're enjoying our game and you're in Red Bay, 356-2021. If you're in Belmont, it's 454-9797. And remember, all these games that we actually broadcast are available on DVD. So if you'd like to get a copy of the game uh, for a keepsake, just let us know and we'll get you all fixed up. Red Bay coming out of there with the basketball. 21, Sarah Williams taking that ball coast to coast, has the ball knocked out of bounds. So Red Bay will inbound. Kelton, no score in the ball game, 439 to go. Get into the Harden, Harden shot up. No good. Rebound backside is Leith. Leith kicks it out to Pendergraf, who will penetrate toward the basket, and it is going to be a jump ball. Error pointing in favor of the Belmont Cardinals. Caroline Gross will do the inbound. This is Red Bay and Belmont. Uh, we'll also have... Uh, Marietta is in this tournament along with Phil Campbell, Deschler, Hamilton. Of course, Haleville is in there as well, along with the Red Bay Tigers and Belmont Cardinals. I know Marietta knocked off Phil Campbell, and I'm not sure who won between Deschler and Hamilton. Uh, 4.25 to go. Belmont with the basketball, no score in the game. Dana Malone drives it down to the baseline, puts a shot up, no good. Her brother is Mr. Brian Malone, the quarterback for the varsity football team down in Belmont. And of course, he broke his arm the other night in the Kasuth game in the first half. So he's out for the season as far as rest of football season. And Cass goes up above his elbow, so no chance of him coming back. So who knows when he'll be back, I'm sure, hopefully before basketball season. He's also the catcher on the baseball team. And the shot by Malone, she makes one out of two. The rebound goes to Pendergraft. Red Bay with the basketball, Williams. And the ball stolen away on the Williams pass to Kelton. Dana Malone takes it coast to coast. Left-handed layup is up good. Coach Chris Hickenbottom and the Cardinals get a steal on the inbounds. Back into Malone. Malone shot up no good. Tipped out. Moody hustling or runs that ball down. And the Cardinals will set it up. Leading three to nothing. There's Carmen Payne drives into the basket. And she is going to be foul. We'll see if they give it to Harden. 
or they may give it to 21 Sarah Williams. They give it to Williams. Red Bay wants a timeout. We've got a timeout on the court with three minutes and 43 seconds to go. Yeah. And if you're out there joining us on a broadcast, we we'll appreciate you. This game is being brought to you by WRMG TV 12 and also Television 97. Just a reminder tonight that uh, uh, we'd love to have you help us support the uh, Cardinals and the Tigers as far as not only postseason, if the uh, Cardinals are fortunate enough to get in. Red Bay is already in the postseason, but we're going to need your help on basketball as well. So we'll be contacting you to help us sponsor those games, and hopefully you'll help us out. Uh, Red Bay knocked off Haleville last night, 28-21. Belmont had a bye and uh, waiting on the winner of that game. And, of course, Belmont playing Red Bay right now. Marietta will either play Deschler or Hamilton in our 7 o'clock game tonight. There is going to be a 540 game in the loser's bracket, which will be the Phil Campbell girls. And that for sure in either Deschler or Hamilton in that loser's bracket. I'm not sure who's in there, but the Cardinals. Carmen Payne makes both free throws is good. Carmen shares the same household with old John Morgan Payne. And we got a whistle and a foul as the Cardinals who already lead 5-0, get a steal and take it to the hoop and it's foul. That's Dana Malone. We're getting her good penetration in. Talking to some of the Red Bay girls before this game tonight, uh, telling them that they did a really good job against the Haleville Ball Club last night and uh, very good pressure defense by the young ladies. And I know Coach Madden is very pleased with the way the game turned out last night. Malone shot is up. It is no good with a violation. So the score will remain. It is a violation against Belmont, so it'll be Red Bay ball. Harden with the basketball, stolen away. Caroline Gross got it. Dana Malone and Payne up there responsible for that. And then Caroline Gross pulls up about a 15-foot jump shot. For this uh, eighth grade Cardinal team, seven to nothing the score. And the Cardinal pressure in the backcourt is gonna draw a tie between Payne and number 14, Leith, and the era pointing in favor of the Red Bay Tigers. So the Cardinal full court pressure right now, uh, paying some dividends. Cardinals leading by a score of seven to nothing. 3.22 to go. And there is a Another steal by the Cardinals and a tie-up into the ball game for the Red Bay Tigers is Destiny Deaton. So the Cardinals will have the ball underneath their own basket with 319 to go on the inbounds. We've got a walk. Going to be charged to Miss Michaela Stevens. Once again, this game brought to you by WRMG. Don't forget, to, we got a copy of every single Belmont football game. We got a copy of every single Red Bay, Tish County. Any junior high game that we broadcast or JV game, we got those games available on DVD as well. Michaela Stevens on a steal from Leith for the layup. It's up good. Michaela, Randall uh, played on the uh, Cardinal volleyball team and did a really good job there. 9 to nothing is the score. Pentagraph will do the inbound for the Red Bay Tigers and Moody will check out of the ball game and number 24 is going to check in for Belmont. That is Zara Pope checking in. 2.53 to go. And the Cardinals another steal but they're going to lose it out of bounds and Red Bay will get it right back. Coach Chris Hickenbottom, thank you so much for the, all the rosters yeah, appreciate Coach Madden for getting us a printed out roster as well. So you just don't know how beneficial that is as far as doing the broadcast. Here's Destiny Deaton. Destiny takes it all the way in, tries to get it to Kelton. And the pass is a little bit wide and out of bounds. Belmont to get it back. Belmont leads nine to nothing. 
Last night, Red Bay got out to a 21 to four lead. Now I will say this, Red Bay is missing Reagan Kirkendall. She is a very good ball player for Red Bay. I don't know what her status is tonight. Uh, she may be over there on the side, not dressed out. Maybe sick on her. We got a whistle and a foul against the Red Bay Tigers. Belmont to go to the line. Dana Malone will go to the line. Jack Ivy, Randall Lindsay here on your hometown station. Hmm? That's Brian Malone's little sister. I forgot Randall and got a headset. So Randall can't hear me talking if I talk about him. Free throw no good. That one, she made one out of two. It'll make it a 10 to nothing ball game, Belmont. Dayton pulls up, soft jump shot. It's up, it's no good. Ball tipped out of there. Red Bay's got it. That's uh, Amber Kelton with the basketball. Taking it down low, shot up, no good. By Pendergraf, and she is going to be fouled. Going to the line will be Pendergraf. That foul against 25, Michaela Stevens. Free throw up no good. It is a 10 to one ball game now. Belmont quickly down the floor. Dana Malone tries to pass it off. It's knocked out of bounds. It'll still belong to the Cardinals. Shot is up by the Cardinals inside. No good. Kaylin Leaf. With a rebound, and here comes the Red Bay Tigers, number 15, getting ready to check back in the ball game for the Cardinals, or getting ready to check in as Faith Storman. Shot no good, rebound by Stevens, down to Dana Malone. Dana drives it all the way in, and it's gonna be a blocking foul. that up when you start back. Can you hear me over there, Randall? Get old Randall fixed up with a headset now. Moore will inbound to Caroline Gross. Caroline dribbling, stops, puts up the shot. It's up and no good. Rebound inside Stevens. Uh, no, actually, uh, it's not Stevens. It's Faith Stormont. And the ball out of bounds and it belongs to the Red Bay Tigers. We have got a minute 45 to go in the first quarter. Live in Red Bay. A little junior high basketball here in the tournament in Red Bay Invitational. Kelton takes it in. Kelton puts a shot up. It will not go. Rebound the putback. No, but Pentagraf. Now it's finally out of bounds. It'll belong to the Belmont Cardinals. One minute and 32 seconds to go. Cardinals with the basketball. Caroline Gross. Bring it down, Caroline looks down low to Pope. Pope got it, kicks it back out to Gross. Gross will shoot a three, it's up, it's no good. Pope with a rebound along with the Tigers, Kelton, and the arrow pointing in favor on the jump, going back to the Belmont Lady Cardinals. I wanna say a special thanks to Sunshine Mills and your hometown Piggly Wiggly store for making this hospitality room possible here. There's Payne foul by Lee. So, Alan, appreciate you and Jason and all the staff down at Piggly Wiggly, of course, for making the hospitality room possible and the coaches and school officials getting treated up here tonight. And we really appreciate, once again, Mr. Alan Bostick at Sunshine and also your hometown Piggly Wiggly store. Dana Malone bringing it back out top with a minute 12 to go. Belmont leads 10 to 1 with a minute 10 to go. 
Malone down to Payne there, and she is going to be fouled. Red Bay roster, Amber Kelton, Lydia Miller, Lexi Collum, Destiny Deaton, Kaylin Leaf, also you got Sydney Harden, Kaylee Markham, Sarah Williams, Bailey Bolton, Lexi Carnes, Maddie Berry, uh, Kara McNeil, Grace Pendergraf, Regan Kirkendall, and uh, Maya Jackson. Belmont at the line, the free throw is no good. Rebound, Cardinals got it, kicks it back out. Long shot, gross, and it's good. And Red Bay wants a full timeout. So Belmont leads it 12 to one. It's been all Cardinals in the first quarter, 58.5 seconds to go. Today's game brought to you by WRMG, TV 12, and also Television 97. You're home for Cardinal, Tiger, and Brave Sports all season long. I'm Jack Ivey with Randall Lindsay with us tonight. And of course, I uh, hope you're enjoying our coverage here. Bates man, I see Sophie, Kate, in the house tonight across the way tonight. And that's Sophie Kate Hand. And I know Coach Roberts is over checking her out. His mom's holding her and Mama and Papa's and aunts and uncles and everybody else looking around to check out the youngster here watching some basketball. Of course, her mama, Miss Haley, was a really good ball player for the Red Bay Tigers. Thought I heard her all the way over here making some noise. 12 to 1. The difference, I think, in the game so far has been the Cardinals' pressure defense in the backcourt uh, getting some good steals. Pendergraf getting ready to check it, bring it all in. Good job of Williams to come back to her. Now back to Kelton. Kelton drives that ball in, stops, tries to dish it off to Pendergraf. Ball got loose, now it's loose on the floor, and we're going to have a jump. It'll be going to the Red Bay Tigers. Appreciate uh, Mr. Van Roberts. He's the principal at Belmont, assistant principal to Andy Chumley, and Coach Chris Hickenbottom for the Cardinals. He's got the world-famous... Anna Brooke Page on the bench with him over there tonight. Anna Brooke's going to be coaching the JV. I know the Cardinals are excited about Anna Brooke being on the staff. And the baseline jumper for the Cardinals on the baseline by Faith Storman is up and good. That will make it 14-1. to 1. Here's Kelton on the breakaway. Malone gets back, and the pass is wide out of bounds. Give it to the Cardinals. Or give it to the, I'll give it to the Cardinals. 23 checking in is uh, Caitlin Moody. Cardinals also dress out Bailey Osborne, Jessica Stiles. Uh, they also have, uh, looks like Savannah Garrison, uh, Lizzie Phillips, Lakin Sparks. Belmont right now leading with the ball. Moody with it. 14 to 1. There's Gross driving in. Missed the layup. Rebound goes to Carmen Payne. Payne backs it out. Kicking it off left side. Stormont shot a little long. Rebound, the putback by Moody, no good. Rebound this time goes to the Red Bay Tigers, and that is the end of the first quarter. Red Bay and Belmont playing to a 14-1 ball game. This is WRMG TV 12, TV 97's coverage. Don't forget any of the junior high games we do this year or high school, basketball, baseball, softball, doesn't matter, football. We have them available on DVD, and if you could uh, purchase one of those DVDs for a keepsake, we would really appreciate it. And uh, folks that get them really do like them, and we appreciate you uh, being a part of Tishomingo County, Belmont, and Red Bay Sports. This is the Ivy Broadcasting Company. <laughs> 